That was the jewel in Halton's plan. His thinking was that the child from this union would be the perfect heir. Someone to bring supporters of every camp under one banner. By seizing the child and bringing it to power, he was ensuring his own place in governing the Seven Kingdoms. But why would Father reveal this to Aaron? Father was very annoyed when he found out what Halton was planning. They had been friends for a long time, but Father was against the idea of using an innocent child to create chaos in the realm. Halton and he quarreled fiercely. Halton didn't want to change his plans, and so Father took steps to protect the girl. So he wrote to Lord Aaron, asking him to take the girl under his protection. When Halton found out what Father was doing, the girl had already gone. Halton was furious. He feared that their plan was now known to the Crown, and that meant the end of the Brotherhood. So, he had Father poisoned. What? That was Halton? He proudly revealed this to me while I was imprisoned. He will pay for that, as Relor is my witness. I've heard enough! We must leave while we have the chance. We will have time to talk once we're out of this cursed place. Wait, Alistair. It's because of another prisoner that I was able to escape. That's who they're torturing right now. I could do nothing for him on my own. But now there are two of us. I'd like to return the favor and help him. He won't be able to hang on much longer. We have to go back to the dungeons. Halton is holding someone else captive? Yes. He's been asking him about a young woman, the King's hand, and his purpose. His fate has been worse than mine. He could well have information that might help us. You have a point. And if this woman is the one I'm thinking of, then what he knows could be used against Halton. No one knows you have escaped yet. We can make the most of that. I'm listening. We have to plan how we're getting out of here. We have to make sure we can escape unnoticed. No one can recognize you. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll leave all the pleasantries to you. There is something else we can do that might help us. What would that be? One of the servants was telling me that the castle's best swords are training in the courtyard right now. Maybe it's a chance for me to fight them and put them out of action without raising suspicion. That would remove a few men who could get in our way. We'll meet with the most difficulty in the dungeons. Yes, we'll likely come across patrols there. We'll have to strike hard and fast. You can count on me. As long as the ointment keeps working, I'll be fit to fight. The pain is almost gone. Don't tie yourself, Garwin. I will not let you die here. I have not forgotten our house motto. It's good to see you again, Alistair. It is good indeed, little brother. We must go now. Ridiculous helmet. Okay, let's go kill dudes that are training so I don't have to fight them later with uh, very crippled moors in my party. Did it, did it. They weren't there a second ago, but they're definitely there now, I promise. is blinding me you have spent a lot of time in darkness brother it will pass I'll wait for you here Alistair no oh, they're over here It'll give me time to get used to the daylight again good idea I won't be long Lord Alistair I knew I'd find you here I could smell the noxious scent of your heresy as soon as you entered the courtyard sir Ethan believe me I share your joy in this reunion I'll warn you now your preaching will fall on deaf ears here we don't drink from cups poisoned by primitive beliefs. Don't worry. I have not come to talk theology with someone of such narrow mind as you. Perhaps we should let our respective gods speak through our swords? You dare to challenge me? I accept. Seeing you fall will prove once and for all that your god is all show and no substance. Save your duel. I would rather test myself against your soldiers. Only the level of the student will reveal the quality of the master. Let's see what yours are made of. Such arrogance. Very well. But if you die, you only have your worthless god to blame. You lot, get in position! 
Lord Sarwick wants to pit himself against you. Attack him all at once and don't hold back. For Castlewood. Uh oh. I didn't know that's what I was doing. And by all at once, we mean one at a time. That's why I saved. Seven hells! Blah blah Light blah! Me. You have spent a lot of time in darkness, brother. It will. You dare to challenge me? For Castle. They say... executed me because that's a great feature just randomly dying when you still have health seven hells the light is blind I'm not gonna bother with his men time in darkness brother it... you dare to challenge me for
about to run all out, so... I guess that's wildfire? I guess it's good to run away from that. Seven hells! The light the is blinding, blinding me! me. You've spent a lot of time in darkness, brother. It will pass. You dare to challenge for ca Take me. The last time I crossed these gates, I was being thrown into the seven hells. I'm sorry to put you through this, little brother. We have to come back here. So don't worry, I'll be fine. The bloody gate is locked. We have to find Alexander. I'll wager he has the key. How do you know? I spent many weeks locked up down there. I had more than enough time to learn about my torturers. This Alexander. He would sometimes watch while the others ripped out my fingernails. We need to set him a trap. He won't be wary of you. I might have an idea. There is a servant girl, Shori. It seems Alexander and his men have raped her. She could help us, and we could help her get a measure of revenge upon her torturers. Can I be of assistance, Lord Sarvik? Well, as it happens, I've come to talk to you about Shori. Has she said something about me? Well, no. I just had some questions about her. Questions, eh? I bet you're wondering what she's like in bed, am I right? Well, I don't know about in bed, but the girl takes it well enough on the floor, eh, Roger? That's putting it mildly. I see. Goodbye, Salas. Isn't she the one I knocked out and shoved in a chest? One of these speech bubbles is her. Sarwick, can I help you? I happened to overhear some guards talking earlier. They were talking about you. Oh no! Take pity, me lord! Listen, I am here to help. You can tell me everything, child. It's Alessander, me lord. He came to my bedchamber last night, he and his friends. I, I, I did not want them to. But Alessander is a knight. I am just a servant girl. I see. He's an animal. I hate him. It is inexcusable what these men did to you. They should be punished. But what can I do? 
I am but a whore to them. A poor servant girl is I like how that guy back there does, is just standing belly. there ignoring it. You may not be able to wield a sword, but there are certain weapons that people say are more suited to a woman. What, what are you suggesting? As a servant girl, you serve wine and food to the guards, do you not? Yes, I do. But why do you ask? The seven take me. Of course. A little poison in their beer and those pigs would never be able to violate a girl again. But I would need to find poison for that. I may have an idea. Wait for me here. I'll see what I can do. Don't go anywhere. So you will help me take... Do not worry, Shuri. <sighs> to rage quit rising how can I I'm interested in poisons and I was hoping you'd be able to share your expertise on the subject poisons I am the only one in the castle entrusted with their use we have dangerous substances here terrible accidents could occur if they were to be used by untrained hands I understand men tend to think of poison as a woman's weapon I know of no knight worthy of the title who is interested in them on the contrary I would submit to you that a knight who has not taken the time to understand the weapons of his adversaries would not be worthy of the title either. Sadly, you speak the truth. You are indeed wiser than most of your peers, Sir Alistair. Would you tell me more about your science, Maester Martin? It would be an honor and a pleasure to talk to you about my work, Alistair. Please, ask me anything. I've heard that you can use the same substance to heal and to kill. Is this true? Yes. As it happens, that is true. But you can be assured that I have never killed anyone myself. How can this work? There are a number of substances that will heal in small enough doses. But in large doses, they can be fatal. The skill is in knowing what the safe dose is. This is the way of the world. For the ignorant, it is full of danger. For those who care to understand it, it is full of opportunity. Would you be able to show me such a substance? Of course. Let's take a look at Heart's Bane. I have a vial of it over there. If you add a tiny amount to a remedy, it can stimulate the patient's body. But only a few drops can cause instant death. Fascinating. This is the kind of thing that interests me. I would like to spend more of my free time understanding such substances if I could. You know, while I was at Bravos, I was working on an antidote to the Tears of Liz. Do you think I could borrow this vial? Well, I'm sure I can trust you not to use it for dark purposes. Here, take it. Thank you, Maester. I'm going to get to work on it immediately. Good day to you. And good day to you. You must keep me informed of your progress. I would be very interested myself. I would be interested to know how your glasses stay on. Now to implicate a poor servant girl. But hey, I won't have to fight them, so there's that. Well, my lord? I have what you need. Pour the contents of this vial into their beer. All of it. No need to be sparing. Perfect. I know these pigs. It'll be easy. They will get what they deserve. Now go, and be careful. Thank you, my lord. Those bastards will pay. Pigs got what they deserved. They are going to the Seven Elves thanks to you, my lord. And you know what? They were carrying plenty of coin. Here, I want you to have some. And here's the vial. I don't need it anymore. Thank you. But you should leave these walls. A girl like you deserves better than to be trapped inside a castle where the lord cannot control his guards. Leave? For where? I have served here since I was born. And you will die here, too, if you stay. 
The games your lord plays are too dangerous. You won't have a better chance than this. You should leave, now. You are probably right. You will always be welcomed at Riverspring if you ever need anything. Good luck, Shuri. May your future be filled with light. Thank you. Thank you for everything. Yay. Gimme. I'm going to the cells. Your master has someone locked up down there who he says would interest me. Step aside, please. With all due respect, you're not understanding me. Huh? The are clear. The cells are too dangerous for someone of your rank. Please turn around. I don't suppose you would change your mind? Not even for gold? Whoever wants to go down there will have to step over my dead body. So be it. You do not want to burn. This is where we're going to be making our escape later. Right there at the docks. I'll never forget these dank walls. Stay strong. It's not over yet. Me too. Not long. It won't be dead. Bleeding hemlock. Archer has some sort of crazy fire arrow. I'm gonna stand here. Die, please. yourself too much, Gowen. Do not forget your hurt. Don't worry. What was that? Seven hells are going to kill him. Do not move from here. I'll take care of this. Save him, Alistair. I owe him my life. Guts, you heard your orders? Finish him. It's time to put an end to the trouble you've caused us, Crow. Now say your prayers. What the? Mors, what in the flame are you doing here? Alistair, is that you? Tell me why I always find you in the worst of situations. What about you? Why do you always take so much time to come? Believe me, it's a long story. Uh, but we need to get away from here right now. Garwin told me that you helped him escape. Thank you for that. Garwin? Your brother? I would never have recognized him. When I let him go, I thought he would leave me to rot here. 
You're uglier than I remember. You must really have upset them. You know me. Always good at making friends. Right, let's get out of here before Halton comes for a little chat with us. All right, but before we do, I want a little chat of my own with that bastard torturer. Moz, we don't have time for that. those teeth, right? I think that should do it. Are you done? This horse hunt was lucky. He was dead before I could really enjoy myself. Garwin, it's you. I didn't expect to see you again. I'm sorry. There was nothing I could do, considering the state I was in. I needed time to come up with a plan. I needed to stay hidden. When I got up there, I came across my brother, and it's because of him that I was able to come back. Two Sarwicks for the price of one. Such an incredible honor. What concerns me slightly, though, is why you are here. Halton has been manipulating me for weeks. He had me believing Garwin had been murdered by the Crown, so that I would take sides with him. He used my emotions and my family to cloud my judgment. The truth was, my brother was being tortured down here while he welcomed me above as a distinguished guest. And that's not the worst of it. Halton murdered my father to protect his little conspiracy. And like a fool, all I was doing was helping him conspire against the Crown. That's not like you to be so naive. What's done is done. But Halton will pay for everything he did. Bye, Gowen. Just master it. This one? did not level up, I think. No. He's not doing so hot. Cool. 11 agility. Hit chance 